Well, these two nuclear power plants behind me are BMK 1500s. They were constructed in the Soviet era, mainly in the, in the Russian Federation. There are the two plants here in uh, Lithuania. And of course, there were the plants at uh, Chernobyl, where the accident occurred in 1986. So there were several RBMKs constructed. They were built to be uh, big, powerful reactors, uh, easy to construct and easy to maintain. They did have some very serious uh, design flaws, which became apparent uh, during the accident at Chernobyl. And so one of these reactors was shut down in 2004 and the second reactor was shut down in 2009. And now the, uh, the Lithuanian authorities are in the process of dismantling these reactors and the current plan is to have completed the dismantling by the year 2038, so in another 22 years from now. What's been done so far is to remove some of the plant in the turbine building, so it's conventional dismantling work. And in parallel with that activity, there have been buildings being put in place to manage the waste, because before you can proceed with decommissioning, you need a, a waste management route in place. The fuel has been removed from one of the reactors and it's in the spent fuel pool, but it's still here in the, in the reactor, so the reactor still remains under operating license. Eventually, when the dry fuel store is available, all the fuel will be taken from the pools and taken out of the reactor completely. And at that point, active dismantling uh, stage can proceed. So all these steps are uh, addressed as part of the assistance programs that are provided by the IAEA and uh, the activities we do in order to share good practice on all of these issues. Mm -hmm.